have heard it on your phones just moments ago. If you live in Duval County, there was an emergency alert that just went out saying there are mandatory evacuations in effect for zone A and B, as well as low lying areas. In fact, I got a text too saying confirm yeah. reply that you saw this. They want to know that you saw it. News for Jackson reporter Ashley Harding is joining us now live from Jacksonville Beach. Ashley, this alert means several things for people in those specific areas at the beach. Yes, it does. And a lot of people are preparing for what is to come. As you mentioned, we're here in Jacksonville Beach. The beach is right behind us, but I want to draw your attention to what we're looking at live right here. You can see these condos. We're watching as these people are trying to put up those covers because as you could probably see when I was on camera, the wind is really starting to pick up. We've watched as some of these people have removed their patio furniture from their balconies. It's one of the things a lot of people are advised to do. And I want to have John just whip around here because I want to show you guys some something else since we're up here. I was just talking to a man. You can see all this sand has been pushed up. Obviously, this is an attempt to uh, serve as some type of barrier. And you can see looking out here at the beach, not a lot of people are out. We see a couple people out and about walking, really checking things out. But it's really not been a whole lot of foot traffic that we typically see here. And, you know, they're watching those waves or thinking about more or less the calm before the storm, if you will. But there are some points I do want to get across to people. If we could just pull up this graphic right here for all Duval County beaches, a curfew does start at 10 o'clock tonight and it goes through six in the morning. Something else to think about regular trash pickup today and tomorrow. Also, no alcohol sales after 10 o'clock tonight. Something else to think about. The Mayport Ferry also closes today. Now looking live once again, you can see there are some people out here, but preparations are definitely underway. And uh, we did speak with Christian Smith with the American Red Cross. She gave us a lot of good advice on those pe for those people who do, do need to make their way out to those shelters. But you can see these people here once again at the condos they are preparing as well we know it's that's really the mode here prepare 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 and also to have a plan in place now we are standing by here in Jacksonville Beach we are continuing to talk to more people and learn about what their plans are we're going to give you their updates throughout the morning here right here on the morning show I'll send it right back to you guys